Okay, I just got this yesterday. I've been wanting to grow tea for a very long time and just haven't pulled the trigger on it. So I finally did the other week, and like I said, I got these yesterday. I'm going to grow tea plants, or Camellia sinensis. As you can read, it is native to South China and Southeast Asia, and it's cultivated all around the world. According to the USDA, this plant is, is good for zone 7 and above. I'm in Northern California, which my corner is about the zone 9, 9B. On the back gives me instructions on how to sow, how to water, and how to germinate. So part of the instructions says to cold stratify seed for 60 days. I have no idea what cold stratify was, so I've searched YouTube, Google, everywhere, and I finally found a video that showed me how to cold stratify. But before I even do that, let's open these. This is my first time opening. Oh wow, they are definitely bigger than I expected, about the size of a dime, a nickel depending on the actual ones. So from what I've been seeing in the videos, which trust me, I've been looking up everywhere for this. This is, looks to be about ripe to me. So, I'm going to slide these back in. And according to the instructions, I'm going to take a paper towel, fold it in half, slip into my Ziploc bag, because we do not want the paper towel to be too wet or too moist, because that will invite rot and I was trying to figure out why do I need to cold stratify this for something that is a tropical plant. Well according to my research it is to help the germination process and to get more success rate. Of course I don't need 25 tea plants so I'll be happy with what I get but at the same time I want to improve my chances as best I can. So I have a spoon and a bowl of water and now I'm going to start applying my water. And basically I'm going to keep applying water until about the corners or only until the corners are dry. Like I said, this is my first time doing anything like this. I have a bit of a brown thumb, but hopefully <laughs> I will have success. So I'm going to put about half the bag in here because as you can see, water is starting to seep to the corners, so it's becoming more balanced. I'm going to throw them in there. Oh, I might be able to do a little bit more. All right, I could do all of it. I wasn't quite sure, so I had an extra paper towel and extra bag just in case. Because I wasn't quite sure. So I'm going to seal this up. I'm going to press my seeds in. Start getting some of that moisture. And now I'm going to throw this in my fridge for about, it said, 60 days. So today is... August 30th. I'll be pulling these out on October 29th. And hopefully then we'll have some success and I'll see you then.